Half the population of 24 Power Fitness have biceps the size of bowling balls and pecs that don't fit in their shirts. And when they're not spending 45 consecutive minutes on the same machine, lifting 600 pounds above their face, they're pulling up their shirts and holding their breath to take ab selfies for their grinder hookups. Yay, you rejoined the gym. And I already want to quit. Why? Being there makes me feel weak, fat, and inadequate. Really? How did you feel before you joined the gym? Not fat. Derek, shut up. We can't all have a 10-pack like you. It's technically impossible to have a 10-pack. Unless you count obliques. I'm gonna oblique your face. Anyway, come over. I need help moving my TV. Can't move it yourself, eh? Maybe you should have joined the gym a while ago. I don't need your opinions. I need your muscles. And come over shirtless. I want my neighbor to see you and get jealous. Boy or a girl? Does it matter? I have to know whether I should apply baby oil or not. You're not getting baby oil all over my new TV. Do you want the full effect, Riley? You know what baby oil does to my nipples? Fine. Put some on your chest. What the hell took you so long? Um, I had to buy some baby oil right now. You were out of baby oil. You slept with someone, didn't you? I don't know which neighbor you want me to make jealous, but the Norwegian girl on the first floor is not happy now. Okay, Romeo, go ahead and put your tank top back on. And don't get baby oil on my couch. Derek! <laughs> Fine. Which one did you hook up with, the hot one? If God has made a non-hot Norwegian girl, I've yet to meet her. Did you meet her sister? No, but I saw her brother on the way out. She doesn't have a brother. Who's that spiky hair dude with the beer gut? That was her sister? That was a girl? And on the eighth day, God made a non-hot Norwegian girl. Come help me with my TV. I'm not saying she wasn't hot. If I was a lesbian, I'd probably be into her. Oh wow, a straight guy who's into a non-lipstick lesbian. Progressive. Okay, that's racist. Against who? One, two, three. Against lesbians. How is that racist against lesbians? Homophobia is basically racism for white people. White people aren't the only gay people, Derek. Well, in certain communities, they call it down low. Shit. Jesus, Riley, where did you get this from and how can you afford it? It was ordered by some old guy who's dead now. They're letting me keep it. Dead guy? Maybe he'll come back and haunt you like in the ring. Seven days. <laughs> what? I only have seven days left in this stupid complex and you wait till now to bring over your gorgeous hetero friend, half naked. Oh, hi, Erica. Who's Erica? That neighbor you just made jealous. You mean Derek? Yeah, he's over shirtless a lot, sometimes pantsless. He loves being naked. I do? I'm surprised this is your first time catching it. He walked by my window, I literally poured nail polish in my coffee. He does that a lot to people. You know, I've always wanted to do a shoot with him. If I'd known his stomach looked like that, I would have been a lot nicer to you. Oh, that's so sweet of you to say. All right, Riley, what is it you want? What do I want? What do you want? Ha, ha, ha.